Hello everybody, today I'm going to talk about UAE pass and the attestation of results in UAE, attestation of any kind of document in UAE. Um, before you attest your result, you have to go to the UAE pass, right? The UAE pass, you have to download it. You download it from Play Store. After you download it from Play Store, you have to enter your details like your Emirates ID card. You have to enter the number of your Emirates ID. You have to your date of birth and other information it will ask you. So after you, you enter all details, then the UAE pass will display, right? You have to enter all details of your Emirates ID. Then from there, you will see your UAE pass. You go to the apps and um, you check it out. It will show like this UAE pass. Then it will show verification of documents, signatures, and other documents, uh, added documents on it. That means you have already downloaded the UAE pass. You have to scan your, take pictures of your face and other details. You will you will find it there then after you do that one then you can go to the websites uh, for your attestation you can go to the website called uh, MOFA right this is Ministry of, uh, of Foreign Affairs of UAE right um, you have to type this one on Google Chrome Google Chrome, that is www.mofaic, MOFA. You have to download this one. Uh, not download it. You have to to search for it. Then you check on the, the website. Then you will see Ministry of Foreign Affairs and International, and International Corporation. Then you check that one after you check that one you make sure you look for attestation you go to the the service right after you go to the service you check which kind of service they have you check which kind of service they have after you check then you look for it will ask you to please select select in which you want to legalize your document so you have to pick which document you want to to attest after looking for that document right it, it will take you to a page called governmental categories and private companies and foreign mission but don't go to foreign mission uh, you have to look for for a place called uae pass right so you go to individual after you type in an individual uh individual it will take you it will ask you for uae pass that uae pass you have to click on that first downloading that you do on uae pass after you click on that downloading pass you click on it then you will verify that document after you verify that 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 one in UAE pass then you will also come back to the to the to the the, the MOFA website after you you press you type your Emirates IDs and you sign in then after you sign in you have to go again on confirmation you have to go for confirmation on the UAE pass you go to UAE pass and you click confirm after you click the confirm you have to go again it will show you you have to minimize it then uh, it will show you UAE pass and Google Chrome after I show you Google Chrome you click you click on the on the uh, authentic uh, authentication um, 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 column says confirm then you confirm it after you confirm it it will uh, send you message on your UAE pass a code that you don't need to share so after you go to that code you then 
copy the, 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 the code then after you copy the code then you upload it on your on your UAE pass then the UAE pass also will ask you um, to enter your, your your password that that means you have already entered password before so you have to enter that password for you to open the uae pass then you enter the uae pass then when you enter the uae pass it will take you directly to the 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 the, the, the morpha um website then it will show you welcome your name everything will appear on the morpha on the morpha uh, website then from there you will uh, you will go to individual you check for individual service but there are many other service there you have service like uh, like a diplomatic service you have um, um, commercial service then you have uh, mission uh, foreign mission service then also you go to to search right that is you go to the, the the individual service after you go to the individual service you check for attestation of certificate then attestation of official do, official paper and certificate and commercial invoice you have to click on it after you click on it it will take you to uh, customer happiness customer happiness center in uae click on that one after i click on customer service on uae um, from there you have to enter uh, which delivery service you need right the delivery service it's a uh, aramex because uh, aramex is the one that's doing the delivery you click on aramex after you click on aramex it will show you uh how many documents you want to you want to attest after that how many documents you have to uh, fill in the form after you fill in the form it will show it will show you 100 percent confirm right after it show you 100 percent confirm you will receive a message on your phone with the message which shows that a certificate which shows that certificates uh, submit after I show you certificate submit, it will also show you uh, confirmation. After the confirmation, then um, they will immediately send you a receipt which shows that the amount that is supposed to pay. Then that amount you have to pay using your Emirates, your, your using your your bank card. You have to pay with that your bank card. You pay. Then after that confirmation will come again that RMX will pick the, the document from you. Then uh, in, in two days time, it depends on which package you choose. If you choose the package of uh, 40 dirhams or the package of 130, I'm sure, you, which one you pick will be more faster. Then after you pick the, docu the, 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 the package that you need, RMX will also call you on the following day that we have we have to pick up documents from you. Then RMX will come to your your accommodation or wherever your resident. Then they will pick the documents for, from you. But you have to download the slip the the receipts that they sent to you. You have to download it on this uh, Mofa um, website. After that, you give your document to RMX. RMX will tell you that, okay, within two, three days, they will bring back your document. Then after that, Mofa will take your, your document. Um, the RMX, with, RMX um, delivery service will take your document to Ministry of Foreign Affairs. The Ministry of Foreign Affairs will then stamp your document. After they stamp your documents within two days, then RMX will also deliver your your documents. Then um, basically, how the 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 how to to apply for your documents? Um, you have to register and log in to existing login account. Then apply. Then you have to pay your fee. Then documents pick up and drop off your documents, which is RMX. 
which is pick up and drop off then um the the, the step that you need to take i've basically highlighted that one you have log into the mofa high website then uh, select the service that you choose to 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 pick which is 40 dirhams then 130 yeah then uh, select attestation of official document then uh, you select um uh, uh, customer happiness then uh, from there you select the courier service that you want to use then after that you select type of documents which type of documents you want to attest right then after you choose the which type of documents you want to attest then uh, it will show you enter uh, the amounts that how many documents you want to attest then from there uh, career service we come to pick up your document and also Korea service, which is RMX also, we come to drop your, 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 your document. So basically these are the way how you can attest your results or your document.